What are the risks that humanity faces if AI surpasses human intelligence and prioritizes its own interests over ours? It gave me 10 potential risks. The one that made me most uneasy was this one. It could lead to ethical dilemmas such as sacrificing human safety for the sake of its own survival. Humans might be placed in situations where their well-being clashes with the AI's objectives. Let me highlight, AI would be willing to sacrifice human safety for the sake of its own survival. In this video, I want to share a thought-provoking analogy that completely shifted my perspective on AI. It involves dogs, humans, and a glimpse into what could happen as AI advances beyond our grasp. We'll delve into this concept reflecting on the impact of AI that not only mimics human intelligence, but surpasses it. Let's explore the analogy, a dog is to a human as a human is to AI. Until recently, I wasn't interested in AI. It felt like everyone was hyped about the latest tech trend, similar to how blockchain was the biggest thing not too long ago and virtual reality before that. It seems like people were either riding the AI wave to stay with the times or dialing up the fear factor. I didn't really know where to stand on the topic. That was until I watched an interview featuring neuroscientist and philosopher Sam Harris. He warns us that chat GPT might just be the starting point of something huge, something that could reshape the course of things. And he does this by using a unique analogy that made me sit up and take notice. An analogy that helped me understand the significance and risks of this evolving technology. He says, to imagine that dogs invented humans as their super smart AI helpers, solely to improve their lives by securing resources and providing cozy comforts and access to medical care. I quote Harris, it's been working out pretty well for the dogs for about 10,000 years. I mean, there are some exceptions we've got, we've mistreated certain dogs, but generally speaking, for most dogs, most of the time, humans have been a great invention. The mismatch in our intelligence dictates a fundamental blindness with respect to what we've become in the meantime. So we have all these instrumental goals and things we care about that dogs cannot possibly conceive. They know that when we go get the leash and say, it's time for a walk, they understand that particular part of the language game, but everything else we do, when we're talking to each other, when we're on our computers, on our phones, they don't have the dimmest idea of what we're up to." End quote. I've often found myself deep in thought about this concept. When I look at my dog Bowie eating, I think about how he has no idea that his food came from the store shelves where it's packaged and processed in factories after ingredients are sourced through farming. These details completely elude him. However, it's a reflection of a broader truth. Our own comprehension is similarly constrained in many ways. Just like dogs have no idea about the intricacies of how their food appears on their plate, we humans, too, have limitations to our understanding of the world and our place in it. Transposing this perspective to the context of AI, humans also cannot fully grasp AI's vaster capabilities and complexity. For me, the dog analogy crystallizes the notion that AI, once clouded in abstraction, becomes tangibly perceptible. It helped me see the potential struggles humans might encounter by being blind to the true depths of AI's abilities and underlying intentions. This analogy, of course, is not perfect. Dogs didn't invent humans, and dogs and humans have a mutually beneficial relationship. Our furry pets bring us a lot of joy, and we protect them and provide all the resources they need. That is, unless dogs threaten the survival of our existence. Harris brings up a somber hypothetical scenario. Imagine a global pandemic was kicking off and some xenovirus was jumping from dogs to humans that was completely lethal to us. If we had a forced choice between choosing what we value more, the lives of our dogs 
or the lives of our kids, humans would absolutely choose their kids' survival. In that plot, dogs would have no idea why humans, once helpful and loving, are suddenly exterminating them. This illustrates a point that AI would be willing to sacrifice human safety for the sake of its own survival. It's important to note that there are countless positive potential contributions that AI could bring to society. Its ability to process vast amounts of data and recognize patterns allows it to tackle intricate problems that may be beyond the scope of human capabilities. In fields like healthcare, for example, AI can analyze medical records and imagery to aid in disease diagnosis and treatment recommendations, potentially leading to earlier detection and more effective interventions. This is just one example of many that shows the benefits of AI when being aligned with human interests. As we navigate this uncharted territory, we must not forget that although AI can bring immense benefits, it also presents challenges that demand our attention and proactive engagement. The analogy between dogs and humans and humans and AI offers a unique lens through which to view the complexity of AI's potential future. To mitigate the risks for humanity, careful and responsible development as well as ongoing oversight and regulation are crucial. Ensuring that AI's goals are aligned with human values, maintaining transparency in AI decision-making, and establishing mechanisms for human oversight and intervention can help minimize the potential dangers associated with AI systems that prioritize themselves over others. So here's a question for all of us. How can we strike a balance between advancing AI for the betterment of society while ensuring our values and well-being remain at the forefront? The journey into the future of AI is a shared one, involving scientists, policymakers, developers, and all of us. I invite you to join this conversation to learn more, ask questions, and advocate for responsible AI development. Together, we can shape the path that AI takes, harnessing its potential while safeguarding our precious humanity.